Hello. Hello, everyone. folks. Hi, Luke. Hey, everybody. Your Hello, Ellen. Over there. Hi, how you doing? It, I'm doing good, thanks. It's so good to see you. It's mm -hmm. Ellen's Souls Academy on a slightly unusual day and time because mm -hmm. we've got a well, we've got we're doing a lot of cool stuff, so our calendar is is somewhat in flux. Mm -hmm. uh, but enough about us. Um, let's talk about the audience. Yes. Now, I know that there's one question on their minds, Ellen. Uh, for those who've been following the series, and it's what's the situation, re sister Frieda? <laughs> re Freed. Re Freed. Um, well, you know, we had more than a week between mm -hmm. the two streams, because the last stream we had was uh, not last week, but the week before. Two Tom Cats yeah. came knocking out the door. Um, and uh, I gave it a few goes, but I didn't get as many chances uh, to play last week. So I was like I said, schedule in flux. Calendar yeah. is, yeah, and yeah, also yeah. Assassin's Creed multiplayer was supposed to be closing, but it's staying open till October. So everyone, if you've never played it, go play it now. It's really good. Um, and so yeah, I was trying to like get as much of that in, but I okay. got a few but really good attempts. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, a few real good attempts. Um, on Freed and I got so close a couple of times I have some recordings of me somewhere where I'm actually swearing I think at some point <laughs> um, but yeah um, I, but what's really annoying is uh, just before the stream we, we had we got set up a bit early and so Luke was like oh give it a go while we're here you know just give it a go um, and I did. I, wanted, and I, I, got, I guess I wanted to see your sort of like the progress. Yeah, see the pro show, you know show how far I come. But roll you know, clip, it speaks for itself. Yeah. Okay. Have fun. Record while we're doing this. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh. Ungreedy behavior. Love to see it. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Oh, watch out. You've been hit. You. Being healed. Oh, is that the visceral? Yeah. I'm not. I've got the visceral. Oh, that's it. Hey, nice. Oh, yeah. There we go. Ooh. Beautiful. Very nice. 
nice. Here we go with it. Oh. Reader. Oh, look at that. Oh, that was great. Poked mid thing. I got a backstab! Oh, you did. <gasps> Come on. Ah! Yeah! <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, Ellen! Woo! Oh my gosh! Tell me you were recording that! <laughs> Alright, well, stop recording it! So that we can <laughs> get it in the live stream! Ah! Right, rematch! Hey, oh my god! Yay! Congrats! <laughs> One minute to four. That was <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh, you had my heart going. I'm sure all mm -hmm. the viewers are feeling the same way. Yeah, I'm gonna save that. Yeah. That. Oh Ellen, my gosh. What's, Ellen, what's my what's my golden frame oh. concealing? Oh well. <laughs> Seventy-two thousand souls that you pulled from Frida's corpse. Yeah. Have Frida. some of that, Sister Frida. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> cool. Oh wow. Oh, Ellen, well done. That was so great. Um, you you're probably watching it back. You could probably detect the point right near the end where I could just tell that you're like once you start to kind of get just a whiff of the. Right, I could do this. I could do it, this. It could happen. It could happen. It was, it was the absolute. I. I it was a mild fluke, but when I like rolled, I was like, I just roll, was rolling to get out of the way and then suddenly found myself behind her. And I was like, well, I'm just gonna swing at her no matter what. And if I get a backstab, that would be good. And then I'm like, I actually can't backstab. <laughs> I can't backstab on <laughs> It was brilliant. You love to see it. I really, really liked that. There was, um, look, I saw a lot of the people in the chat focusing on how good your rolling, dodge rolling was in there. And it was, Thank you. Um, but for me personally, it was the uh, healing Thank timing you. that Thank I thought you. was so good. Uh -huh. You were just, you know, hitting that heal button yeah. as soon as as soon as you could when an opening was there. I, I didn't it, think I was going to yeah. get through that one because I, I thought I'd used up too many heals in the first round. And the there was a round, point where you got hit for like almost mm, everything. Almost everything in that second um, round. But then like I, I yeah. went into that last round with like not not too bad like and uh yeah there were just moments where i'm like i suddenly looked down at her health bar and i was like oh, this, <laughs> this, is, this is nearly like because there, there were a couple of times i've got to there and then i've panicked like in a i could do this and then well i could uh, i could tell i mean i, I didn't say anything because i know better but like yeah. but you know in those last moments i could sort of sense the, the kind of the, like oh where, is she, where is she she went invisible and and mm -hmm. i could you know, I was like, ah, I could, ah, 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 where is she? Yeah, <laughs> that was brilliant. Well done. Hit that like button if you liked that. Yeah, um, like, spike, I suspect please. You did. 
Uh, right, I'm going to read some chat. Also, Ellen, um, even though um, this Zoom meeting um, yeah. is uh, from a licensed account, it says the meeting's going to end in 10 minutes, so I don't know why what? that is. So I might have to. Um, you might have to, like, hide me, and I'll start a new call, and okay. everything should be the same and stuff. Right. But I'll read some chat first. We've got a few minutes. We've got a few minutes. Okay. Dan in the chat says, Cheers, mid ears, and good luck on your soul's adventure today. Please can you say well done to our youngest who started our own secondary school adventure today, and good luck to our eldest who is heading into year 10 tomorrow. Of course. Of course. Big adventures in the Mr. Team mm. Corvette household. Heck and we yeah. Wish, we wish everybody... All the best, and you know, if, if you you've got a niece or a nephew, or if you or anyone, it's the first day of school, then uh, you good luck. You're gonna good smash luck. it. School is easy. It's not easy. It's like Dark Souls hard, but <laughs> just look at what Ellen's doing to Dark Souls, and that's what you're gonna do to school. Yeah. Stuart Dobby says, "I'm blaming you guys for my near 500 hours in Dark Souls 3. Why did you make the games look so fun? I don't know. I, I don't know. I wasn't aware that we did, but that's good." Um, and Alio, uh, Alio Lex says, Hey Luke and Ellen, like many people, you inspired me to give DS3 another chance. I ignored all the advice Luke gave and used the Zweihander the whole way through and just finished the game. Good luck with me, dear. <laughs> Cheers. Nice. Oh, yeah, enjoy, Cheers, enjoy the Zwei. Angel Beat says, Congrats on Frida. That fight was not a scythe for sore eyes. Hey. Very well done. Ashen. Um... Right, Ellen, stuff. you've spent your souls, which is mm -hmm. brilliant, and leveled up. Um... Mm -hmm. We've got mid -ear coming up, but um, I think that there's a, just a few bits of business that I think we should polish off in the, in, in, in the area that we were in. Okay. So head on back to the, I want to say the Ring City Streets? You want to be heading to the, fire, to the bonfire that's just by the, uh, which one is it? Um, what's Shared Grave? No, not that one. Uh, yeah, Ring City Streets, I think. Or it might be wall. Whichever one has the puzzle. The use the show your humanity one. Ah uh, ah uh, ah, uh, of course. <laughs> I think that might be the other one? I'm not sure. Oh. Patrick Bukowski says, Hi Ellen, Luke watching Ellen's Academy. It's always a pleasure. Uh yeah, I think this, yeah, this is the us. right one. Yeah, this is the right one, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, so I tell you what, I'm gonna hop out. This is a good point for me to do my Zoom admin. Resend, yeah. Yeah. Um, basically, Ellen, if you while I'm doing that, if you could kind of pop out into the swamp and just kind of kill a few things nearby. Okay. Um, just like just make sure nothing in the, you can stand in the swamp safely. Okay. Cool. Uh, cool. All right. All you right. disappear. Be right Bye. back. Bye. Boop. Off he goes, and he's gone. It's just us. Hey everyone, it's just me right now. Luke will be back. Um, don't worry, this is not. This isn't stray. Um, it's a bit different. Uh, but I played through the whole of Stray on this channel. If you'd like to go and uh, watch that, that was a, a delight to play. If you want to see me cry harder than I would in Dark Souls, I would say. Oh, come on. Little bugs. Woo! Hello. Oh, there's that guy. Oh, gosh. They're all out for me now. You. Oh, gosh. I wish you were. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. Wow! Ouch! Not co not cool! Oh, I think I'm gonna die to these things. Oh, yeah, I am. Gosh, Luke leaves for five minutes and I'm already dead. There's loads of them. They came out once. That's all right. We've got this. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, I'm keeping an eye out. There's the call. There we go. Luke's coming back. I've made progress, right? Open Zoom meetings. There we go. Look at me multitasking. There's my souls. We'll get those back. Oh, oh why can I not? Join this thing. Join. There we go. Oh, wow. Don't squirt your 
butt at me. What the hell is this game? Alright, got me solved, that's fine. Ah, you. You were over here, that's fine. There we go, yeah. Nice try. A little sip sip. Any more for any more? Okay, we've got Luke. Hello, Luke. Hi, Ellen. Right, okay, two seconds. I'll bring you Where's back. Where's my frame? Get your frame back. There we go. Lovely. There we go. Well, wow, right. uh, great, Ellen. It looks like you did exactly as asked with no difficulties. Uh, mm -hmm. it looks like yeah, you're definitely a, did not. Yeah, cleared out not die. bit of the cleared out bit of the swamp, which is great to see. Uh, right. Well, I now shall partake in telling you the uh, solution oh, to the puzzle. There he is. Come on. Oh, I see the other ones that will head poking out. I shall partake. I shall partake. I shall partake. You shall not partake! I shall partake. Right, Ellen, yeah, you've done I'm more than enough. To be honest, you just need to be stood. <laughs> oh, gross. In their butt mm. glue. <laughs> yes, well, no more of this butt glue. Right, use a young white branch. Um, so what, the puzzle, right? so if you're not familiar with this, then frankly, okay. you need to search for our list of, oh, um, gosh. Yeah, of most obscure okay, so Soulsborne like puzzles here, that I? you were never going to solve. Um, but yeah, the, the clue says, a young white branch, perfect. The, key, the clue says, use your humanity. <laughs> nope, do it again. What have I got to be? You've got to, well, you'll not see. the crystal? Not the crystal. Oh, I remember. <laughs> I haven't played Elden Ring, so I've never got to do this before. This is very funny. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Frodo Baggin says, Can I ask for a birthday shout out? Also, I think Auntie Mabel from Come Outside would have enjoyed this fight. She always said, Hello, my dears. Oh, um, oh. Of course. Uh, Frodo Baggins, yes. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, hope, Frodo Baggins. Hope all is well. Always nice to see you. Uh, um, see your comments. Come on. Oh my gosh. Oh dear. Oh dear. I've got five attempts at this left. Hey! There you go. Now walk back to the uh, puzzle. Painstakingly slowly. Uh. You know, a humanity from, from Dark Souls. I look like something from Rick and Morty. Yes. Oh, gee, Rick. I don't know, Rick. <laughs> Uh, Patrick Bukowski, I was in the middle of reading your uh, comments, I think. Watching Ellen's Academy, always a pleasure. Good luck with Sister Frida. Oh, good work, even. Oh. By the way, Ellen, as Gollum in Show of the Weekend, deserved a bloody Oscar best performance ever. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, yeah, I mean, it was one of the two best performances. I mean, yeah, I, you got to give props to Luke as well. Yeah, right. It's amazing. Wait for it. Oh! oh. Yeah. And Megan Oppy says, first time I've been able to make a stream in a while. Wanted to let Ellen know that my cat Squid watched all of her stray videos with Aww. me, despite normally being indifferent to what I watch. Squid's cheering you on. Ah, oh, cheers, Squid. So many people sending videos of their cats watching either me playing stream or just them playing stream. Uh, uh, stray, even, sorry. Just so cute. It's so cute. Oh, man. Good stuff. Hello, by the way, everyone oh. in the Discord chat. Sup, Discord? I see you there. If you want to join the Discord and join the exclusive Discord chat, you can do so by going to patreon.com slash oxclub. There are other, other benefits behind the light besides the live stream hangout, but boy, it's a good one. Right, Ellen. This area contains... Do you remember the yeah. NPC lap? Yeah. Well, do you remember what lap was after? Oh, dang. Nice. Woo! Hmm. 
Yes, now you remember what break makes those, Ellen? Oh, oh, for goodness sakes. No! Don't fight it. Find the thing. Yeah. Oh, he's up there. Ah! Mm, bad times. Ouch! There it is. Yeah, it's a hell of an area, this one. You got those knights to fight. Uh, if I were you, I would um, avoid the knights, mm -hmm. run up and uh, kill that thing. Yeah. And then, uh, you know, and then see where you stand. And then hopefully both the knights, you haven't got both the knights involved. But at least, uh, you know. The ladder's done. At least your ladder's done and you're right there. Charlie Stack in the Discord says, looks like a pretty garden though. It does yeah. look very pretty. Yeah. It's a pretty garden. It's a pretty garden. Still loving this backless dress so that my uh, jerky skin. <laughs> yeah. Mm -mm. Fully on display. Showing a bit of leg. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. right, go for it, Ellen. Sprint, 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 sprint. Round to the right here. Start wailing on the big guy. Stuff. Get my uh, souls back. Divine nice. blessing. Lovely. Titanite chunk. Great. Oh, I can hear something. Oh, there he is. Now, uh, yeah, see if you can. Ooh. Oh, dang. Wow, what a combo. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, I hear ah, it. I hear ah. it. Oh, dear. <laughs> well, it's all happening. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh. Whew, good dodge. I hear another one. Oh god. We Come on, buddy. I would heal up. Oh, I thought I had. Drink, drink, drink. Ooh. Drink again. No. No, he's too fast. He catches up on you too quick. Definitely heal though. Yeah, well, I can't because oh. he's wailing on me. <laughs> oh. Okay. Well. Do I have to do that all again? Yeah. <sighs> well, actually, no. Um, what I'm going to suggest while you're on the way up the ladder um, is you can basically... There's not even, like, anything to get here particularly. You just need to, like, have nominally, like, found something. Okay. So... Yeah. So I would recommend, once you get up here, like, cheesing it past on the right, running past everything, you'll find a staircase going down to your right. Mm. And just follow that. And that'll probably get you out of range of the bad guys. You can stay here and squash knights if you prefer. But I think anyone who's played this will know that it's a, it's a, a fair enough bit, to, bit of the game to skip. Uh oh! Archers! Oh my. What? How did he. I killed. 
killed him. No, no, no. St stop, 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 stop. Lock on. Oh my god. Right, I just want to get my souls back and find them. Souls back? Ellen, those things just weigh you down. Mike Ferrin says, DS tech question. Dark Souls, I assume that is. Do they feel an Ellening in small parts or all at once? Ooh, good question. Um, I mean, assuming you're referring to... Ooh. Dark Souls enemies. Hmm. I'm gonna say that you feel them all at once. Do, 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 do. Bonk. It's good. Knight well dispatched. Yeah. I I pressed it, but it was like, now nah, I'm not gonna do it. Where usually it's like, okay, I'm gonna do it after I've landed. But just didn't do it that time. All right, come on. Oh my. No, I got stuck against a wall. As you can see, the camera is not moving. I can. I saw you get stuck against the wall, Ellen. It's pretty unfortunate. And with not enough health to survive a. a, a... I was trying to roll out to the side to take some healing potion, but we learn by doing. Again and 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 again. All right, all right. What I'm going to do as well this time to try and dispatch that guy a little bit quicker. Oh my gosh. Come on, ladder. Could you be any longer? Oh my gosh. Sorry. Nice. I would say, don't forget, seeing as you're two-handing, don't forget that your um, uh, like R2 skill attack is like specifically for poking under shields. Yeah. I won't use it right now because I've forgotten how to do it. Go. Now, hopefully, you can fight one knight at a time. Oh my gosh. Very nice. There we go. Let the stamina refill. Stuff. Sip, sip. Next night. Save two nights. Uh, fight the breaker. Done. Oh, there he is. Hello, sir. Me, dragon face. Oh my gosh, she did a two part move that time. Yeah, I got move sets for days. Oh god. Drink, 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 drink. So it's, you'll need your stamina back up, but it's hold L2 and then R1 or R2. I can't remember which one the attack, but they're both, they'll both help you out. Well. Eh. Or maybe you go for the backstab. No. No. Okay. No. 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 Okay. No. No.
It is relentless. Mm. <sighs> but you can do it. I don't do feel like I can do it right now, Luke. I need some pep talks. I need some. I need some. <laughs> All right. Well, you know that was good. Just um. Oh, that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that was, was good. good. Yeah, well, was no, good. It was you, well, there are three enemies up there, and you killed two and a half of them. So <laughs> go do it again, and this time, and this time, um, you know, slightly better. It's all right. There's, a, there's, I'd say the 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 Don't rolls feel maybe better. a little a little panicky, and you can probably um, the healing opportunities are probably bigger than they seem. Um, but uh, it's yeah, just it's yeah, just so it. many of his move sets. That one, <laughs> that spear one, especially. It's three parters. Yep. And it's just trying to find a gap in that like It's it's it the it's um just you know keep the panic under control. There are only knights. You beat yeah, Sister Frida. That's... Shane Coffee says, you got this Ellen. Um Plenty of enemies in the game you thought you couldn't beat in the past that you've since bested. Thank you. Very true. One hit. It's the end. It's, we're nearing the end of the DLC, isn't it? This is, they, they're throwing everything at you. It's as hard as it hard as it gets. In it, you sound like me. You've been in London too long. <laughs> oh. Mike Perrin says, "Ellen, my name is Parry Rose." <sighs> I don't know whether I can parry with this shield. I can't remember, it's been so long. And Mephi to go says that is not the hardest it'll get. <laughs> no. I'd say as well, maybe like walk, don't run up to the big guy so that you've got all your stamina for hitting him. Give him less time to start summoning jerks. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that was a good shout. Alright, programming a couple of hits. Oh, for goodness sakes. See, now that was a, a little greedy hit-wise. Oh. Uh, posted. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> just feeling sorry for myself right now. I got it, I got it. I'm just going to... Oh, from the, the highs of Frida to the lows of two knights that are kind of giving me a hard time. This is the... This is the yeah, this is Dark Souls. This the is Dark the Dark Souls, Souls experience. experience. Yeah, you beat a hard boss and, and then you're go like, and get yeah, your butt kicked over I'm the and over best. again. And then the Dark Souls is like, you think, yeah. you think. And really. Pearl says, "Can I say how much I appreciate and admire that you are pushing yourself through this, Ellen? You can do this. <laughs> I'm not pushing myself through this. Luke is dragging me <laughs> along as I'm like, I can't help, help me. I'm forcing I wanna, you through it. Like, I want to do it, but I can't. Like a Play-Doh squishing machine. <laughs> yeah." I'm going to be some real cool green spaghetti by the end of this. Woo! Woo! Go. Now. So. Oh, that was a. That's all right. Get, get your stamina back up. Don't forget that rolls are eating your stamina as well. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, you're good. See, look at that. And now a huge gap. 
if he gets you, as long as your health is full, you're all right. If that was Sister Frida, she'd have scythed you twice in that in that gap. There you go. Looks a good oh. one. There All right, good. Right, there we go. That was a bit of good luck. Get your stamina up. I get out of there completely. Overextending a little again. There yeah, we go. Yeah. There you go. The shield. Oh, Oink. Bam. Uh. <laughs> Dan Pell says, okay then. This is with a, uh, a super chat as well. Here's more money to motivate Luke to keep pulling you through this then. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there we go. Hey, did right. it. Now that staircase on the right is your reward. I, there one. might be some items up here. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think there is. I have run all the way around it. Oh, I heard something awful then, but I don't know. Okay. <gasps> Head on down. Oh. Oh, it's the clonky boys. I can hear the clonky boys. Okay, where the do I go? Boys. There's a ladder uh, against the wall here, I think. Or, I mean... Ah. Yeah, there it is. Eh. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. Anything around here? Yeah, there's an item. Is anything gonna drop down and try and kill me? Probably. Yep, yeah, there you are. Hello, sir. There you go. Off you drop. Dragon head shield. Lovely. Nice. Anything gonna drop down on the way back? Probably, but oh well. Alright, no, nothing there. Great. Okay. Ooh, large soul. Delicious. What the heck is that? And look at that. That's horrible. That is the purging monument. Oh. Now, yeah. Now head on up to it. There should be an interact option. Um, Pray to the purging monument. Yeah, press X, but then don't choose anything from the menu. Just go okay. leave. I, I might be wrong, but I'm concerned that choosing some of those things might affect the ending that we're going for. Right. Um, I'm not entirely sure. Right, and then basically you've done what Lap wanted, so now our job is just to go back to Lap, which I think, in a, in a rare concession, the game lets you do by hopping down off one of these walls. Like um, uh -huh. I, I, I'm a bit turned around looking at the screen, but... Um, uh, but yeah, generally speaking, uh, you want, you just want to get back to lap, which you can also do by going back to the bonfire. Quite, quite yeah. Quickly, so. Yeah. I think he's over there in that ringed the kind of building to your right. Yeah, that now one. in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think if you run around. over the other way where you've got that shield, and then you yeah. can drop down there. I think right. Get you there. I think, I think, I think. I get in there? Is that a night down there? Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. God, I can hear the... Oh, you. There you go. So I think it's this path ahead of you. It takes <laughs> you to lap, I believe. Yes! Results! Okay, Hello. good stuff. What did I come here in search of? Oh no, he's forgotten. Damn. Stop it. I'm unbreakable. Oh. Unbreakable. Poor lap. Are you certain of that? Yeah, 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 it's no. over there. S sorry. It's back there. I, I knew you'd never <laughs> lie to me. Thank you. Thank you kindly. I'll speed right on over. All I'll right. be now before I know everything. Oh. Who I was. What I lived for. Is it going to be some horrible, tragic what thing that was. he didn't really want and to know? You to thank for it all. <laughs> don't, well, don't thank me just yet. Well, that wouldn't be very thank dark souls, would it? Mm. I swear upon my birth name 
that I am your friend. No matter what might come out, oh, gosh. no matter what I was, if you would do me the honor, allow me to be a true friend. Or <sighs> Bet you find out like he was your sworn enemy. It won't be long now before I know everything. Who I was, what I lived for, and what my name was. Lovely. And I have you to thank for it all. Great. So having having done that difficult thing, solved the puzzle, found the monument, we can yeah. now, um, you can travel, I mean, travel back to a bonfire and you can head to one of the bonfires that we unlocked and we can finish this quest line now. So, um, uh, yeah, I would use your magic infinite homeward bone. Mm -hmm. um, back to the one last rested at and we'll travel from there. Oh, actually, I might uh, top up some healing because I've got um, 94,000 yeah I might just spend go up a level on one of them get some more health or something all right also for the lords of cinder for the ashen prisoners there we go all those held to preserve the fire all right okay look I just I just need to level up um, what hour are we up. looking? I'd I'd put strength up. I don't like um, I don't like your mm. I don't like your health being higher than your strength. Okay. Personally, I don't know how much that's soft... putting. Let me check what the. It like attack power is not going up. Uh, Defense is, but. I mean, it, yeah, that's that's. Mm. That's normal that it, you know, that it starts not going up each one, uh, especially once you hit the the, the little cap. Right. Um, plus a team, plus a team. Uh, yeah, you are starting to get less and less HP as well and health for, for vigor. Mm -hmm. Ah, put it wherever you want. You're clearly doing great. It's like endurance isn't. It's just helping. Stick it, stick it in vigor. Vigor yeah. to a nice round fifty could, would be a reasonable goal, yeah. I think. Yeah. to give her probably. Yeah, um, oh I don't know. Rubbish. What 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 ashes can I give this, uh, this it's, lady? it's a different part of the menu. Oh, give there we go. Ash. Give captain's ashes. There you go. DJ Turley says any chance I you could shout out my dad ash. Del. First time he's able to catch a stream since yeah, all the way back in November when you gave him a birthday shout out. Of course. Oh hello Del. Del Hello Del, thanks for tuning in. I hope he doesn't mind that with my accent I say it with a W. I don't say Dell, I say Dell. Dell. <laughs> Dell boy. You know. Listen, Dell. <laughs> oh, Dell. <laughs> oh, Dell. Uh, let's have a looky. Uh, oh, I don't want to fetch someone else's cell phone. I was like, why have all my things got to there? Those twenty thousand, three of that. Oh, I could do all three of those, and then no, one of those, and then I can go Ashen up one, one. more level. Ash one for the Lord Link. Very well, then tuck in. All right, let's get bigger up again. For those wondering how many souls my character has on their person, the running total is now up to. Let me just look at this. Oh, I've done it too many. I... Six hundred and ninety thousand. <sighs> nice. Um, yeah, the required souls was not. I was doing. That's not make it. That's not the difference. That was just how many you needed. So I did twenty thousand extra than I didn't need. Ah. I mean, I wouldn't worry about it. You get like twenty thousand just for stepping out your front door at this yeah. point. Yeah. The, the, yeah. I mean, like, the build is—it's done. You know, this is the oh, end yeah. game. Like, we're not, we're not gonna. Oh yeah. We're not gonna. We're 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 really really twiddling in the in the margins. Right. Okay. So yeah, shared grave. And then when you get to the shared grave, um, turn around. So don't go through the door out to the outside turn where we fought Medea. Every now and then we 
fall apart. Is this the best way to win? I think so. It's a great big dragon. So you I'm started Roman singing, Ellen. Zuki, right? Remember when you started singing and didn't listen to what I was saying? Yeah. Yeah. There we go the other way. To <laughs> <laughs> Lol. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, Luke. Sorry. That was just where I was last time. So is it in like in there or just keep down? Uh, no, you just want to head. <laughs> there you go. You just want to head down and down and down and down here. Find. I'm gonna find laps. Last yeah. location. Leave it. Leave it. Oh, for goodness' sake! Okay. Oh, now I need to go up and then. Ah. <sighs> oh, hello. Woo! Off he goes. <laughs> Brilliant. See you later. <laughs> nice try, buddy. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. This is on there. Let me get a go. Oh my god! Oh. I. There you go. And then down this way. <gasps> Something's going to jump out, something horrible. Oh, no! <laughs> no, lap, no! Is tainted by the greed of men. No! Such as I, devoid of all worldly wants. Is that Patches? He was Patches! <laughs> it's Patches! <laughs> Why did I not recognise it? It was just so gentle with the voice. That's good voice acting. Well done. I have to say, like, when I did this, um, I was... <laughs> <laughs> when I did this, it caught me... You know, I was really surprised. Um, and then afterwards felt really dumb because I was like, it of sounds exactly like... And sounds, watching yeah. this back, I'm like, surely... I wonder if Ellen is like, oh, it sounds exactly like Patches. Yeah. But I think, you know, because all of the Dark Souls voice acting, you know, it's, it's quite... It's done by the same, distinct, like, but few people, but they do... It's different... all very much of a piece. Yeah. yeah. You hear a lot of NPCs who sound a lot like Patches. Anyway, now Patches has sort of trapped you a little bit, but not... Not, not really. really. So I'm you can, go yeah, down you this can way. Just sort of go down here and then you can go all the way up. Uh, well, because now you want to find Patches, right? Yeah. So now you want to get up... There we go, so it was a good job we killed everything here. Yeah. Uh, ah! Love it, love it. I find this little, like, area of the game just endlessly confusing. I just, I just cannot get my head around, around it. Oh no, I didn't want that. No, no, there we go. Got Jacob says, curse you, sudden Whoa. but inevitable betrayal. Alright, that's the way down there. Can you see you can probably see the uh yeah, the item. Oh yeah. Ooh. <gasps> that's the bonfire we've already been to. That's Don't where rest I was. at it. Where do I So you want to head down here but not not, not down, down. Yeah, not not do the fall. You need to go. I need to run and jump across that. Uh, I don't think you need to, but maybe you can. How do I do? Oh god, how do I jump again? It's been a while. Click in the left stick. That's it. Okay. 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 Someone truly dedicated could make a pretty good supercut of all of the click in the left sticks. Nope. Yeah. Eh, no worries. 
So I think I think now if you maybe now if you head down. I hate this bit. I hate this bit so much. I you know what? Just run around until by random chance you find it because I genuinely cannot cannot deal with it. Dead end. It drives drives me absolutely up the wall. Angel Beat says I can't believe he's done this. Can't believe you've done this. Oh. Stem bones, stem bones. Awkward ghosty says, look for little pieces of cloth marking the right way to fall. Okay. Maybe good advice. The oh. other thing you can do is teleport to a different bonfire and approach it from another direction, which I would get you there in under one minute. Mm -hmm. um. I can, like, hear. You have to go to where Patch's kit. Oh, okay, okay. Drop down there, Ellen. Mhm. Mm and then go like as low as you can go. Mhm. Mm there you go. And like now, drop down there, like off the edge. There ah, it is. okay. Lapsed hey. armor, so he's dropped all his armor. Okay. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That is it. The... Oh look, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah it's yeah. the end of your. But isn't that where he kicked me to? Yep. So he kicked me to there. Kicked you to there, yeah. But lap was up, you know, up there. Yeah. From kicking you up there. So yeah. that's how you get lap's armor. Oh, uh, okay. So, all right, all right. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So that's so it. That's it. We are, we're done. Yay. We're done. Yeah. So that, that is lap's thing <sighs> concluded. Phew. Well, that was hard. Let's do something nice and easy, like fight Dark Eater mid -ear. Yay. Okay. So, um,. Uh, you want to head back up to that bonfire we just rested at? I would. Just, you can obviously portal straight there, rather than we can leave behind this godforsaken tower uh, for all time. Do 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 do, and this time do run straight ahead. There is a shiny item there. Is this gonna kill me? Probably. But let's give it a go. Ooh. Oh, it's a big building. Oh. Oh man. Well done, Ellen. Good stuff. Now I think in this room. There is a hidden wall against that wall to the left. That's the right. And if I'm remembering right... Oh! Yep. There you go. You're like, hmm. Not much of a reward for opening this hi hi invisible door. <gasps> Ta-da. And then you're thinking, hmm, that's not much of a reward for opening this invisible door. <laughs> Absolutely ridiculous. Oh god, why is it Oh I was in a cobweb, that's why. I was like, why has it gone all blurry? Oh so man. Stupid. Could you clip the last minute? I'm I can't uh yeah. I don't remember if I have that footage. Um of that stupid triple invisible wall. Oh wait oh god. Uh say short clip. Last minute, there we go. Nice. Right, and onwards and upwards. There. Buddy. There we go. Hello. Oh, this looks promising. Mm. Can I, can I take that? Give me, take give me. It. Can you take it? Absolutely not. How dare you. You're going to have to be more cunning than that, Ellen. Mm. <laughs> he 
you should be aiming a little higher. Oh, is it like? Oh, oh, oh! I've got to come in through the ceiling, have I? What if I'm I come in through the ceiling? You have defeated Dark Souls. <laughs> imagine. Imagine. Just like that would be on every list that we yeah. do ever, wouldn't it? Right, I'm very turned around here now. Did you spot a elevator at any point? Did you go uh, on a lift? Uh, no, I've not been in a lift. Oh right, you may you may have not explored as many doors. There we go. <gasps> this is a very pretty elevator. Lovely carvings mm -hmm. on it. Mm -hmm. And what's here at the, oh, up at the top? Is that a friggin'... Oh my gosh. Oh, welcome shortcut. There you go, your final... Um, Love it. Final shortcut on what will be your oh boss shortcut. Alright, give it a rest. Alright. Now let's make a journey that, in all likelihood... <sighs> You might have to make a few times. A few times, yeah. Ooh, let's head on down here. Now, you want to hop off this halfway halfway up. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Which side? Uh, I don't know, Ellen. Gosh, what am I I'm gonna got to do it? Moon on a stick. Ah, there. Okay. Do you like proper Dark Souls and swing the camera wildly on every lift that you're on? <laughs> Mmm, two sneaky roots. Oh, is this a... That's not a lift. An ember. Mm, now have a look at this room, Ellen. Look at this. Let's look and see if there are any of these statues. Do you notice anything interesting? The answer is no. There is mm. nothing interesting about them. Hmm. So that's it. All right. <laughs> whoa, 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 Ellen. Look closer. What do you see? That one doesn't have a sword. Ah! Da -da -da -da. Oh. All right, hang on. <laughs> oh, wow. Very nice. All right. Well, scooched. It's not a hidden. That's not an invisible wall, is it, at the end there? I don't think so, but... <laughs> no. On the on the right. Hang on, just try, try left as well. But no, I think if it's no, it just looked it just looked so unplastered. Right, before you go down there, it's probably worth um, going the other way. Oh look at! <laughs> oh, yes. Look what's just spawning in! Oh, outstanding. Fell down that ladder so many times. All right, all right, all right. Have a look this way. Hello? Hello? Where do you think that might <gasps> lead? <laughs> oh, 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 good. Claranthe <laughs> ring plus three. Plus three, it's bloody Heck good. Yeah. I think you're wearing the Claranthe Cl ring, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. Plus one, though. Oh. Garbage. Yes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Never worry about stamina Love again. It. All right, good stuff. All right, where's the wall again? That side. Okay, let's do it on the way down. It's easier. And Whoop. help. All right, all right. So there. That's that one. And is it down here? What have you done? <laughs> Lol. Yep. Right, okay. Now, Listen. what kind of Dark Souls player would be so careless as to fall down a ladder that is so obvious? I'll tell you, Ellen, someone who is doing it for the 20th time, very distracted and tired. Yeah. <laughs> Riviera Kid says, you haven't really played Dark Souls without falling down that ladder. Antiquated playing garb. Mm, not much cool. of a reward for... Um into this room. There's a big hole there, though. Mm. Death ahead. Mm, accurate. Dragon ahead. Okay. Also pew, accurate. pew! 
Pew, pew, pew. Pew. All right. Okay. Do I go down? Hell yeah, you go down, Ellen. <sighs> what are you going to present? Present Ellen Rose with a deep, terrifying pit, and she's not going to jump into it. Ah, oh, cool. Damn, that looked awesome. That did look awesome. Mm. Gosh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Right, okay. Uh, can I think of any... I mean, there's, there's no advice that I... Uh, well, you know what? The only advice I'll give you for now is put your shield away. It's yeah. not going to help you. And don't bother praying because nothing can hear you down here. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Hiya. Hi, mate. Let's just have a little tickle. Woo! Oh, I'm so happy we're here. Oh my gosh. Here. Oh, it's amazing. It's amazing. Very nice. Oh God. Oh no. Oh God, it's Calamite all over again. to survive that. That's how you know you have enough health. That attack that just hit you, I believe, is the attack that Oxbox featured in one of their um, one-hit-kill attacks features. Oof. Inside me, dear. Oof. Oof. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. Wait, I'm gonna leg it. And... No, I was there too close. Okay. Wow. Right, that was good, Ellen. That was good stuff. Okay. Uh, right, let's talk about Dark Eater Madeir. Okay. Dark Eater Madeir is so strong and so hard to fight. That's the first thing I would say. The second thing I would say about Dark Eater Madeir is um, uh, all the attacks hit so hard, but you've already found that out, right? Yeah. What um, here? Uh, because this oh, yeah. is because you unlocked a shortcut. I'll let you kill this. Right. Memory. Okay. So Dark Eater Madeir hits um, so hard, mm -hmm. which you know would be fine. However, the other thing about Dark Eater Madeir that really, really makes him uh, unique and special and beloved um, is that Madeir has an absolutely titanic hit point pool like mm -hmm. an in, an enormous bar you you r landed loads of hits on Medea and you saw how far down it got the health bar like maybe a quarter of the way or something so it's, <laughs> yeah it's a war of attrition and this is one of the few Dark Souls 3 bosses where actually one of the biggest challenges is not running out of Estus because you know mm -hmm. even if you hadn't been killed there 
at the rate you're going, you end up like halfway yeah. through the fight with no Estus left, and it, it just becomes so difficult. Um, there are like lots and lots, obviously, there are lots of different strategies uh, for fighting this dragon. Um, I would say that it um, bringing in a summons does not necessarily make this fight notably easier because it increases that gigantic health pool even higher. Mm. Um, uh, but, 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 but you know, um, it's uh, let me see what what else. Um, yeah, there are loads and loads of different points of view. So many, so that like whatever I say will irritate someone in the chat. But I will tell you broadly speaking how I manage this one because we have very similar builds, right? Mm -hmm. Um. Uh, lots of people say don't lock on Yeah, I think do lock on I lock on sometimes and then when I'm underneath I just go for the legs because otherwise you're always looking at the head yeah the leg hitting the legs is a bit of a false economy hitting right. the head does notable damage right. hitting the tail does notable damage Right. but what I would say is that you'll start to notice that when Medea turns around sometimes there's a kind of like line of like an animation line that follows the tail mm -hmm. and that indicates that it's a tail whip attack and that is really really hard hitting it doesn't actually mm -hmm. look very fearsome but it's um it it will you know it will mess you it, up it, it could easily one shot you that Medea's weakness is a fairly limited range of moves mm -hmm. so once you have those moves clocked and you figure out how to dodge them and they all can be dodged or you know, you can if you see them coming, you can position yourself around them. Mm -hmm. um, you uh, yeah, you you you've absolutely got it, and you don't need to worry. Okay. Um, Daniel Bjorkman says, "Don't let Medea intimidate you. You just got to learn his rhythm. You're not fighting him; you're dancing with him. That's mm -hmm. a nice that's a nice way of putting it." Mm -hmm. Bobby's World two one one O says, "Currently replaying Dark Souls three right now, and guess what? I'm stuck on Medea. Good luck, Ellen. You've got this." And Apollo Kandinsky says, "What many of us are thinking? Frankly, Medea, I don't give a damn. Go, Ellen." Ah, and Luke in the Discord says, uh, Luke brackets not that one, says, rolling away <laughs> from the attacks also works better than rolling into him, unlike most Dark Souls bosses. So there you go, something to bear in mind. There you go, that's, that's pretty good. You can almost never get more than two hits in. Another good idea is, um, unlike the Nameless King, I think it's a good idea to try and try and keep Medea in front of you, like in the game, so so that so that Medea is always facing you straight on like this, because then attacks like that are much easier to to see and to, to telegraph. Oh dang! Let's time that. That was good though. Nice nice few hits. You'll have you'll have all this memorized before you know it. Oh god. There you go. You see those little openings? That's basically the window. Good. You're dealing real healthy amounts of damage. No, that I see. I was thinking because Nameless King, it kind of goes in front. Yeah. The attack that I found, and ah, now this one, um, where you don't want to be where that white beam has gone. It's not just about it hitting you. You've got to kind of stay oh, away from okay. where it is because it's got that kind of big follow-up explosion everywhere it touches. There you go. That big charge attack. Um, I found that one really hard to to dodge. There you go. See, see yeah. if you lose the lock on like that, which you will if you get too far under him, it becomes so tricky. There you go. Very nice. 
really nice. Okay. That was great. Yep, very nice. E. I'm messing up. Oh no. <sighs> that's a very nameless king S. Yeah attack that one. Uh, this is the one that's turning into the big thing you do not want to touch. Now you're behind him now, so you're kind of safe. Oh, said Luke incorrectly. But watch out for the tail whip as he yeah. turns around. Oh god. Oh ah, god. Now you want to get away from that. Oh god. There you go. It's, it's alright. That's actually a good sign because you've got into his sort of second... Phase. Nothing's really changed uh, except for that big AoE attack, and sometimes he'll summon a bunch of ghosts that you just kind of need to run away from, and roll around and stuff. Oh god! Ah, there's that tail swipe. Iconic. Okay, I don't think I've got this one, but I mean, I've got no S just left. Is the thing. It's all right. Don't get hit again. <laughs> hey, okay. Alright, what is that? Oh, one? now this attack is real special. Ooh, ooh. Mm. That was good. Could you just clip that last 30 seconds for me, Ellen? It was just it was just such it was just such clean footage of a very um very, go. very good and famous attack. Three minutes, right, that was go. good. As you can see, Ellen, you you would have if you had twice as much Estus, you'd have had that. Yeah. So that's the kind of shape of this fight is that it's unfortunately it's a real war of attrition, real patience, real um, real not getting hit, that kind of thing. Angel Beat says, "Ah, the attack." Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but lots of the chats are saying uh, how amazing that was to get to 50% on your second attempt. And Thank I you. Quite agree. It's because quite, quite I agree. spent so freaking long on Calumet. <laughs> mm hmm. Alright. Just a little hand sticking out the top there. <laughs> Uh, Norton says, so I think Madeira is weak to lightning, but I'm worried that if I say this, you're going to ignore me as trolling, but try bolt paper. <laughs> Good luck, Ellen. This guy was nearly my breaking point. Eh, there's no point. The fight's so long that any, like, buffs like that that you apply, they'll be unapplied by the time you're 5% of the way through the fight. Eric says, now what possible justification is there for giving a dragon what appears to be an orbital laser cannon? That seems a bit extra, even by Dark Souls standards. Give him hell, Nell. You've got this. Thank you. There you go. So let's just let's just uh, take this as a sort of memorization, of, you know, opportunity. There you got you got the rear up and roar, and then one and one then bite. One oh, There's oh, the charge. Oh, when you see him kind of go like yeah back yeah yeah, back I up press the wrong in button a, in a cat-like kind of way. Um, but the thing is, like, oh, there you go. The two swipes. That's your. Oh focus. God. Such a good opportunity. I, I, I was trying to find a little space to sippy sip and did not. It's all good. It's all good. I got this. I got this. So Hoi Bay in the Discord Ooh. says he has such stroppy toddler energy with his flailing yeah. fire, breathing, stompy <laughs> attack. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. I'm just like in love with his aesthetic. I think it's just very good. Really cool. Very also, um, it's the best boss music in the game. Oh yeah. In my opinion, <laughs> which is why it's the music that's in the trailer for this series. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm -mm. 
Mm -mm. Cannot believe he's like hidden behind all of this though. It's so funny. I know. So easy to miss. Feel really sorry for the first person who found me, dear. Yeah. Mm. Like, oh, what's Whoa. this? Ah! <laughs> ah! Big F off dragon. It's definitely worth doing a plunging attack when you drop down, just for the animation effect of yeah. your sword, like scraping against the wall. Yeah. Well, it's also the sh it's the shield as well. Amazing. <sighs> Come, on, buddy. Again. Look at that wingspan. I just love how like gruesome he is. Sometimes, you know, like I love the I love the character design in these bosses, but you know, sometimes you just want a honking great dragon. And for it not to be too complicated. Very nice. I'll get him in get him in front of you again. Oh, here comes the awesome oh laser. Oh, God. <laughs> wow. I thought it was going to go to my left. <laughs> that was amazing. That looked so cool. Here comes... Is this? Are we going to get the crouchy launch? Yep, there it is. Boom. There you go. And just a couple of hits. And get in and get him in front of you again. It's so fast. And especially because it can come from like right across the arena and then he's like just on you in one frame. Is that the orbital cannon? No. It's, no. You don't really appreciate it when you're playing, but it everything about this like is so cinematic and looks so cool. This is why like when people give this fight is exactly why when people give the camera a hard time in these games, yeah. which you know is fair enough. But it's like sometimes it's frustrating to play, but it's like it's it's allowing for this unbelievably be, like bonkers thing to play out. Get him in front of you. I know. Very nice. Punish the fact that he swiped at you, even though his swipes are easy to dodge. Sound is helpful as well when you're running away like that. Ah, kind of... oh, there you go. Nameless King in it. Oh. Right. Nice, easy one. Oh, more for you, my dear. Medea should take damage for that one, for charging into a wall. Yeah. There's a funny old delay on some of these. Uh, oh, God. Some of these attacks. Don't forget to two-hand, by the way. Yeah. Oh, come on. See, like, there's one where if you're far away and he goes, that's the laser. But if you're right underneath him, see, mm. this is the laser one. Yeah. Which is, you know, it's okay oh, when God. you know. Oh, God. <laughs> so, such perfect timing. It's, it's, it's okay. okay if you know what you're doing. It's okay. Dead. <laughs> I was way. Oh. oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
some folks in the Discord are linking to a um a video on Zully the Witch's channel, which is uh called Tiny Midir. Mm -hmm. It's like a it seems to be a mod that makes Midir small. Really small. Yeah, and it is Midir. real cute. Mini deer. Yeah. Oh, just doing like a tiny little <laughs> mini laser. Oh, the laser's not that mini. Oh, that's funny though. If he's like really small and there's <laughs> coming out. <laughs> all right, all right. In a way, this boss is um, more straightforward than mm -hmm. a lot of bosses. Yeah. You know, there's no tricks. There's no traps. Just a heckin' strong dragon and oh you God. in a room. Nice. Well done getting him in back in front. Should be able to punish him after this. Silly Medea. Getting the lock on back there. He did not want to give it to you. Oh god. Come on, game. Let me actually know what I'm doing. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That one where he takes off and kind of flies at you. I may be wrong. But I think you want to kind of sprint to the left. No, sorry. To the right. <laughs> uh, it's like he shoots. Ah, oh, that was lovely. Beautiful dodgeage. There you go. Lovely stuff. Just Medea is, Med oh, stop, stop. Medea is just like, excited. <laughs> Medea is just excited to teach you a cool dance. Yeah. That he's made up. He's like, you go this way, stomp, stomp, stomp. This way, fire, fire, fire. Laser, laser. Zoom, zoom, yeah. zoom. Fly, it, fly. Crush. And then it goes swipe, swipe. Oh wait, was it two swipes or three? Oh, I'll just do both. One, two, one, two, three. Frodo Baggins says his laser breath reminds me of Shin Godzilla. And then supplies a gift to mm -hmm. demonstrate mm -hmm. exactly that. Yeah, for sure, definitely. Awkward Ghosty says, I imagine having Torrent here would make the fight a bit easier. No. I mean, yeah, a lot of the time, but think of think of when think of the stun lock when you get knocked off. Torrent's kill. <laughs> I'm a dragon! What do you <laughs> think of that? Here's more fire breath! As a dragon, it's one of my many moves. Okay. So he paints like a cross in front of him. Come on, here comes the charge. Come on, my dear. Do the cool charge. Now, 
let's just watch the end of this. Yeah, there's a good, like, one and a half seconds, maybe, at the end of that oh, attack. Oh, well done. And now, swipe time. Yeah, look at that, so punishable. I think if we see him doing the um, one that's going to end in the white fire. Yeah. I think, I think run for his head and just try and, like, hide out under his chin so that you can get in those punishes. Yeah, and look, there you go. His animation just kind of stops at the end of the charge as well. <laughs> Nicely done. My dear, focus up, That's mate. Oh, no. He's doing so many fire attacks this time, and I don't know if it's because you're keeping him at range, but it might be. Feels so satisfying to hit his head. The noise, the sound is just perfect. Nack says, this game sets off my monster hunter instinct so badly. <laughs> it's alright, that was a good run. I was pleased that, that was alright. I wasn't, mm. I didn't get much in, but I saw some things. I saw some things. Oh no! <laughs> 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 I faced the other way and I was like I want to go that way and rolled but I pressed roll a bit too quick and so I hadn't changed directions yet so I wanted to roll into those pots while I was waiting but oh well it means that lift should hopefully be there for me oh look I can pick up my zero souls I just to do that that's all I wanted good it's a rite of passage yeah it's an Avatar Rite of Passage. It's not really a pun, is it? Uh, trying to think of a pun. All right. Here we go. All right, you got to get it this time, Ellen, because if you don't, I'm going to use the next run to the boss to plug my podcast. Oh, man. Yeah, that's right. And it's going to be tedious and um, self-congratulatory. And Well, I'll and... also plug a podcast that I was in recently. Tell you what, I get the first run. You get the second run. <laughs> then there's even more incentive. You oh you plug your podcast when you when when Medea dies. <laughs> that's how we'll do it. That's how we'll that's how we motivate ourselves as millennials. Oh is um plugging podcasts. Donk. So not this time, but next time we see this one, I think I think it's punishable. I think you can punish him for doing his big attack. Just two. There you go, very nice. 
Woohoohoo! No thank you! Oh dang! Alright, what's your podcast? Well! <laughs> <laughs> it's the latest episode of Mum Can't Cook, a decom podcast with me and Andy from Outside Xbox talk about Disney Channel original movies and the latest episode is all about the 13th year uh, which is about a boy who starts turning into a fish boy. <laughs> What? Um, yeah, he just starts, you know, experiencing those changes that all teenage boys go through at some point where yeah, we he start gains. Gills. Yeah, and now Ellen, you know what fish are. If you, if someone was going to turn into a fish, what kind of powers would you think that they would get? Could breathe underwater. Yeah, that's a that's a great example. Good swimmer. Um, uh, uh, yeah, Cody does become a good swimmer. Can't swim underwater though. Right. Sorry, can't. Sorry, can't, can't breathe underwater. Can't though. breathe underwater. There. Okay. Can you think of any other fish-like powers that you uh, think might make sense if you were writing this film? Maybe uh, can like swim really well, like with others, like in like a school. Um, oh, no, 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 can't do that. Uh, can do. You're that stumped. Thing Let me suggest one. How they, about like, swim so fast that they like kind of shoot out of the water like flying fish? Uh no, I can't really do that. How about how about this one? Seeing as okay. just dumped. How about sticking to the ceiling? You know, sticking fish-like to the ceiling. Mm -hmm. Well, that's one of Cody's powers. Okay. How about this one? Shooting electricity out of your mouth. Okay. <laughs> right. I'm gonna stop plugging my podcast now. There you go. All right. Mid ear. Some person says, go, Ellen, do the thing. Yeah, it has got nothing. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Don't worry about it. Oh, there's the flying fire. Oh, ooh, run up to the head. No, That's all right. I think we discovered there that it, there's definitely space to get some hits in. Did we? <laughs> yeah, well, we just spotted the move too late, you know. There it is again. Get up to that head. No. Even when I'm like right there. Ah, you can do it. I believe. God, where is he? Oh, he's on fire and flying. Cool, cool. I hate this camera sometimes. Do the cat wiggle, do the cat wiggle. He's just doing fire. I think you need to stay closer to him. I think he's, um, I think that there's been so much fire that he must be doing hit like a category of attacks that is specifically for long range. I think try and keep him closer to you because it's these claw attacks that are really, a, you know, a treat in terms of dodging and punishing and stuff. And this, and, and whatever you call this. I mean, come on, my dear. Failing to keep your cool there. Only ever two. There you go. Close up distance. Yes, yes. Straight under his chin. Under his chin. You can do it. You wait, can do it. Wait. Believe, believe, believe. It's the fire, though. Well done for healing. I know. Temptation must have been there. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's the kind of stuff we like with here. 
Oh my god, not that though. Double charge attack. Don't worry, you're, you're finding a really good balance of uh, aggression and caution. Every attempt is a fact-finding fact mission. Yeah, this is good, this is good stuff. Don't get too far away from him. Because we want more of those nice non fiery attacks. Big toddler stomp. Doing the toddler club bop. Oh my god. No. I was out of Estus. Well, don't worry about it. His health bar's just so big. I know. I know. It's just so much. Yes, it really, really asks that you basically don't get hit at all. I think this is the only boss fight in the game, uh, and th this isn't really a brag because, like, the way that Dark Souls is built, often looking up like strategy guides and like how videos on how to beat this boss isn't that helpful because your character is going to be so different to anyone else's. Um, but this is the only. A boss in this game I think where I had to look at some look at a video like a proper kind of and now we're going to freeze it please try to remain calm mm -hmm. you see this attack you see this attack and it actually it did really help kind of just sort of visually make sense of, of the fight so Ooh. do not worry do not worry you've got it for Pete's sake, says Luke, have you done something to your eyes? They look great. And then you got this. Thanks. Um, yeah, I've got a little bit of uh, eyeliner on because of uh, something we were filming. Full stop. Um, oh, Ellen, we forgot to plug your podcast. You said when I be. No, I know, but that was a silly rule. I want to hear what about the podcast, so we'll do it after after this one. Unless you beat Medea, in which case you can't plug your podcast. done. Oh, here comes the fire. Yeah, it's to the left, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but I lose the lock on, so I can't tell where he actually is. Well... Great. Great. No. Lost him. Oh! Nice! Good to know you can roll cleanly through that fire. That was awesome. hand for that ever so slightly yeah. increased um, thing, thing, thing. 
Oh, I don't dear. know why I'm not two handing. I asked you to do two hand. There's just so much happening on screen that I didn't even spot it. There's flying fire, right, I think. I'm running off to the left. I don't know where he's going. Well, it seems to have worked. Wow. Dragon. There you go. Only two. You need the time to. Well, I pressed two, but she went for three, so I must have panicked. That's perfect. Oh, come on. What was that camera? Um, the worst. <laughs> yes, that is the best one. That is the one that is just to like, yes, please. Thank you for thank you for this present. Here. Oh, I think we're going to get into uh, phase two. Yes, run away from that AOE. Well done. The music has gone berserk. The music's trying to make you think that the fight just got harder, but it hasn't. It's very oh similar. Oh god. Well, I lost Estus. It's alright. You only need one. Well, I don't have any now. Oh, to the left, to the left. No, that's the right. Oh. <laughs> well, I, I thought you were saying he's doing it to the left. <laughs> you thought I was st st stage. Yeah, because... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here he comes. Oh, God. It just goes on so long, doesn't it? I'm simultaneously having all and no fun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Woo, but at the same time, I'm like, Woo. <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, I was on the Safe in Our World podcast, yes. chatting to the lovely Rosie about uh, video games and mental health, and then also Jane and I. For those of you who uh, might be fans of Drag Race, uh, the lovely Mr. Joe Black invited uh, Jane and I to go on and he interviewed us and it was lovely. We had a lot of fun. Amazing. We uh, made up some characters for ourselves in the upcoming Fable game. It was all really good. So, yeah. And what are the names of those podcasts, Ellen? So, it's Safe in Our World. Um, if you, Safe in Our World. If you check out them, you'll be able to find uh, their podcast via their social media. And then Mr. Joe Black, spelled M-I-S-T-E-R, J-O-E, black like the colour. Um, and uh, you'll be able to find them on Spotify and podcasts and Apple things and all that sort of stuff uh, on various things. And it's a lot of fun. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Oh. 
God, what else can we plug? Oh, there's an interview with me on uh, Idle... Idle the, Champs. Um, the Idle Champ. yeah. Um, you know, as you know, our D&D characters get added to the Idle Champions. I believe uh, the official there is D &D still D &D time to pick up Dob. Yeah, I think so. So if you want to pick up Dob. <laughs> and who wouldn't? <laughs> I've already... I've got Dob. i got Dob. And also Corazon is available right now. Because I got Co Dob and Corazon this weekend. Because I'd missed Corazon. And Beeple skins. And Beeple skins are available to purchase. Yeah. Which look amazing, I will say. As much as I... Uh, but yeah, go to the Idol Champions YouTube channel. There's an hour-long interview where I talk to the excellent Trevor. Oh, Trevor's so nice. Uh, from Idol uh, Champs about all sorts of uh, different subjects, not just Dob in Idol Champions. In fact, we've probably talked too little about Dob in Idol Champions. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, it was a really good chat, so go check that out. You clown, my dear. You know you've just handed two snout hits to Ellen on a plate. Bang, bang. That's it. The snout just got. Yeah, yeah. I'll try, I'll try a charge attack. I don't bloody well think so. Charge attack. I don't think so. I'm having lunch with the gruffalo. <laughs> Here we go. Good job, Ellen. What was that? <laughs> the gruffalo. No? Oh, I know the Gruffalo. The Gruffalo's great. You, wait, you know the Gruffalo? Yeah. This is putting me off eating you. Uh, these, these are very deep cut Gruffalo gags. Yeah. Um, so I hope our audience of Dark Souls 3 fans are familiar with, um, I think, British yeah. children's book, <laughs> The Gruffalo. Let me lay some Gruffalo facts on you. There's a stage show. Yeah, I've been on the Gruffalo walkthrough ride at um, Chessington World of Adventure. Wow, there's a Gruffalo ride. Chessington yeah, I mean, I wouldn't, now. you know, I wouldn't get, I wouldn't get too excited. Walkthrough ride, and oh. um, yeah, but uh, but you know, for, for for Gruffalo heads out there, you can't you can't beat it. <laughs> um, yeah, it's by author Julia Donaldson, oh my God. illustrated by Axel Scheffler. Revolver Rock says the Gruffalo is kind of like Shrek for toddlers. I guess. See it? See it? First published in 1999. Yeah, it's God, been around it was like, a while. I thought it was like five years old. There you go. Adapted into a 30-minute uh, film featuring Robbie Coltrane in the title role. Yeah. Isn't like David Tennant in that as well or something? The title role of the Gruffalo. Uh, I think David Tennant is in Snail and the Whale. Um, right. But may also be in the Gruffalo. <laughs> Julia. Yeah. Julia Donaldson wrote Snail and, Snail and the Whale. As well as, of course, Room on the Broom and popular character Stickman. Oh yeah, Stickman. He's huge. You mean he's 90 feet tall? <laughs> yeah. Roop. Nice try, my dear, you chump. You big dragon chump. Oh yeah, look at this. Phase two, easy. Easy. Music go. Satan himself conducting. All right, Ellen. It goes on for ages and ages and ages. There you go. Oh, 
Whoa! My word. But look at the end of that. Exhausted. Yeah. Exhausted. You could probably get enough hits in for a for a full um, posture break repost there, which I believe is possible to do on Midir. Which obviously is, is another thing that kind of makes this second phase. Oh, oh yep, yeah, here's those ghosts. Just keep rolling. And keep, keep rolling. Big AoE. Nice try, Midir. You chump. What do you got? What do you got? Oh, more ghosts. Right, this is another good reason to stay close to him. Because now more attacks. The long range flavour. Lovely roll. Absolutely lush. Three hits. Midir doesn't like it. But he'll have to go along with it. Yes. 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 Feel the music coursing through you. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It's all right. Oh god. You're doing good. Ghosts. Ghosts. Good. Ghosts. 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 There you go. A little tickle. Got four flasks left. That's a really good amount. And the reason you've got so many flasks is because Medea's not hitting you. Because you're really good at Dark Souls 3. Dear you grumpy toddler. There you go, well avoided. Yeah, exactly. See, you, look, you're, you're reading him like a book. A, a well-thumbed copy. Oh, here we go. Good stuff, perfect roll. There you go, work your way towards the head for the punish. Yes, that's the visceral, if you can land it. You sure can. Bloody hell! <laughs> now, Ellen, 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 Ellen. There's three minutes left of the stream. Oh Look at the camera. Oh Look at the camera. Yeah. Tell me, half an hour ago, did you think? I that... didn't think I was gonna beat him today. You didn't, didn't think didn't you were think... gonna beat I him thought, today. I thought I was gonna be like on holiday, going, oh no, because I'm gonna be away for a couple of weeks. That's why Dark Souls is today. And I thought, oh no, yep. I'm gonna be away from the. I'm gonna get real, real bad, and then I won't be able. Luke, that was I, I want to hug you right now. Let's have I've a got... let's have a beep, 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 beep. <laughs> <laughs> Great stuff. That was brilliant. And what did I say? Once like you know, once you got his move set yeah. red, you know, yeah. like at, like the second half of that fight where he was doing his bigger, scarier, stronger attacks, you were taking less damage because yeah. you knew what was coming. I knew it was uh, Colton Schiffer says, congrats <gasps> on beating my favourite boss in the Soul series, Ellen. Awesome to see how far you've come in your Soul's journey. Thank you. Uh, Angel Beat says, that was absolutely gorgeous work. Amazingly done, Ellen. Uh, Ellen, it does not get harder than that, in my opinion, in the Soul series. Um, definitely not in a Dark Souls game, I don't think. So, I mean, obviously that's subjective, don't at me or whatever. But, you know, <laughs> no one would disagree a spec spectacularly hardcore boss and yeah you absolutely absolutely made mince meat with two minutes left before the stream we have Man. we have so little of dark souls 3 left next stream mm -hmm. uh i am almost certain we will be fighting uh the final boss of uh the of the dlc uh, uh slave knight gale mm -hmm. um there are some more uh, there is, there is one more boss um mm -hmm. but it's kind of a novelty boss for reasons that we'll explain on the next souls academy and after that ellen only the final boss awaits you are within grasping distance the the exactly the finishing ribbon 
is is in sight. Awkward Ghosty says, I've never played I've played this game for thousands of hours, never thought of punishing the laser cross attacks. <sighs> GG Luke. That was that was amazing. Um right. Yeah, that was epic. Dwayne G says, Congrats on graduating Dark Souls. <sighs> Thank you. Uh, next Ellen Ring. <laughs> no Dwayne G <laughs> You all have to stop asking. It's too big. We've got and Avidos in Chulak 2 says, Frida and Medea in the same stream. Ellen, in a two hour span, and this is true because there was two hours left of the stream yeah. when we started. <laughs> in a two hour span, you have defeated the two hardest bosses in Dark Souls 3. <laughs> right? <laughs> Wherever you are right now, just give, Ellen oh. a little, just give Ellen a little clap that Thank she deserves. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That everyone. was, that was wow. absolutely immense. Oh. When are we when are we streaming next? So I can't wait. I want to I want to keep going. It's two weeks on Thursday because I'm going to be away for a bit. So it's just it's, uh, like basically the first the first day of EGX, uh, the Thursday of EGX. Um, yeah. We we won't be at EGX on the Thursday because we'll be fighting things in Dark Souls. But then we will see some of you at EGX for our D and D mm -hmm. um, on the Friday and the Saturday. Hopefully that would be amazing. Um, and yeah. Oh my gosh! Cool. So it's oh. the is the the twenty second of September, the Thursday. Yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thursday, like you say. Cool. Well, we'll see you then. Yeah. Um, Cannot wait. The Discord has exploded in gifts. Thank you, Discord. The like button has melted. <laughs> um. Oh, amazing. Gosh, what a way to end a Monday. That's great. But you know what? The fun doesn't have to stop for you folks watching. Because you can jump across over to uh, Johnny Chiodini and they are streaming right now. What are they streaming right now? What are they streaming? What are Johnny they doing? Is, <laughs> Johnny is uh, doing some miniature painting oh, and how um, relaxing. Yeah, and uh, when uh, when this stream ends, you when we hit end stream, out. you'll be automatically redirected to their stream. So yeah. uh, look forward to that. So yeah, don't press anything. Do not touch that dial because we are going to bounce you across to another great live stream. Mm -hmm. uh, Shell Claire points out that you had four flasks left, Ellen. I know. Is that Alex That's Rigo so says wild. excellent work. Showed old laser face who's boss. Yeah. Amazing. And the hardest bits in this stream was that stupid tower that Lap lives in. Mm-hmm. Okay, that was. Oh man. Lars Eliasson, Ellen is an absolute unit. Truly impressive. Thank you. Cinescon says, "What are we supposed to tell Johnny?" Um, uh, tell them uh, there's no such thing as a Gruffalo. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good. Uh, All right, amazing. Ellen. That oh, was immense. Man. Oh, More immense Dark Souls work for you. down now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, yeah. Big glass of water. Mm -hmm, Lie down. Mm -hmm. Let that heart rate return to normal. Oh, amazing. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you for joining. Thank you for talking me through your your as ever. Your your words have been extremely helpful. Um, oh, you're so you're so welcome. It's been an absolute pleasure to watch you take Madea apart. Oh. The um the 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 good times are going to keep on rolling, and I mean bad times really, because we do have a few a couple. We do have a couple more absolutely monstrous fights uh, coming up. Uh, yeah, oh, well. brilliant. Hit, oh, well. hit that like button. Yeah. Um, thanks for joining. We'll see you next time. Don't forget, loads more videos on the channel this week. Blades in the Dark. On the Friday, finale. The finale. The, the finale. The finale. It all ends here, folks. Yeah. And and what an incredible session it is. I can't so wait good. for you to see it. It's so it good. So excited. Epic, but in, in the meantime, sense of the word. Exactly. Exactly. But in the meantime, go say hi to Johnny from us. And uh, have a lovely Monday or Tuesday for our Australian and Asian viewers. Hello, Auntie Kiwi. Bye. <laughs> Bye.